on the Thames today. Our last day here in England. And to see if we can eyeball some little bits of treasure. I didn't care at all which way I did go. Didn't mind the hunger, the wind or the rain or the snow hole Cause I was on the road to what I wanted to be Just another man moving down the highway wild and free way to the back of the boat. Thank you. Friends, mud larking. Not really finding much of anything out here today. But still having a good time. Beautiful. That's a lot of people out here. I think maybe. This is one of those salesman samples of bricks or something. H.C. Webb. Feels like brick. I'm going to take that and then we'll look at it and see what it is. Research it. Garbage and trash. I was gonna walk away, 
I noticed this little beauty. It's only a partial. It's only half. It's broken on the other side. But look at that. That would have been gorgeous. Look at that piece of a pipe. Wow, look at that design. Don't know. Can't see maker's stamp. Maybe once I get it back, we'll be able to see it. That's really cool. It's a pretty little piece of a pipe. There's a bottle right here in the muck. Uh, it's a wine and it's not very old. So we'll leave it. But that's kind of cool. There's a more, another more modern bottle. We'll leave that one. interesting little piece of pottery. It's like black on the bottom. Let's say. Wipe it off. <laughs> it says England on the bottom. You know I'm going to have to take that piece back with me. That's awesome. Found this beautiful little piece of pottery. It says something on Avon. 1792. It's probably not that old. It's maybe a commemorative piece, but it's pretty cool. we've heard is a Victorian era dump and right here I found I think it's a doorknob like maybe an old kind of fancy doorknob and then right over here I think this is a key it up, but I think it is a key. Have to see if we can knock some of that extra rust off of there. Glass container. It's got a broken edge, so I'm gonna leave it. It's a cute little one. I just eyeballed a little button right there. I don't know. I don't think it's very old. Whew. It's got a name on it. E. Grove. Lambeth. That's kind of a cool little button. I'll put it in my pocket. this bottle out there that looks embossed and it looks old but it is in the muck I don't know if Jeremy can get out there without getting stuck he's so close 
He's gonna make it. <laughs> Is it a cork top? Is it a new one? You did all that for a new one. New one? Kind of a weird area out here on the river. You can see all these bones mixed in with all the rocks and stuff. There's thousands and thousands of them pile up right here. Okay, sometimes you'll find like a old tool made out of bone. Definitely have a hard time passing up these pipe stems. It's hard for me when I see those just to walk away. It's such an old piece of history. But we have a whole, whole jar of them right now. What are you getting? Ooh! Nice one! So Ooh. I, ha I have to tell you, that raven was standing right next to him. He was leading you. He led me to him, and then I got him, and then he squawked a couple times and flew off. He did? Wow. Here, can I see him? Just look at it. Ooh, those are nice. Awesome. Yeah. That is a big piece of pipe stem. I'm going to have to take that one back with me. Lots of pipe pieces. Pipe pieces. And look at that. Part of the bowl. Part of a pipe bowl. Look at that. That's cool. So I'm just kind of poking around in these rocks and stuff underneath this old dock here. And so far, here's what I found. Cool little I don't know, shot glass maybe? Some kind of food jar. It's kind of cool to find anything whole out here. And I've uh, got a cork out of a bottle. I like finding corks, it's kind of fun. But as you can just see, there's just pieces laying everywhere in here. Glass, and I really like to find bottles. I really have a connection with bottles for some reason, but so many rocks, pottery and tile and just cool stuff that uh, some of it's embossed glass, some of it's kind of old, others it's not. There's a shoe, there's a bone right there, kind of cool. lots of bricks. So if I find anything else cool, I'll Turn it back on. And I just eyeballed this little thing sitting down here in the rocks. I don't know if it's whole or not. Let's see. <laughs> sure is. Just a cool little jar. Probably leave that for fellow mud larkers. Just set it up here. Next to this beautiful leaf, there is a little beautiful piece of a pipe. Look at that. Broken, but there's still a lot of it there. Look at that. Wow. Awesome. Just walking along here and I look over and there's some kind of bird, goose, or duck, or something. I don't know. Doesn't seem too nervous of me. take our final boat ride of our trip here in England. That's our ferry over there and she's going to come back and get us. We just got dropped off up here. 
and had a good day mudlarking. Found a couple cool things. Beautiful evening on the Thames. Beautiful, beautiful evening. streets in Greenwich, London. This, these fox here in London, they're almost domesticated. He's just sitting here watching the cars. He's watching the people. A cat just walked behind him. He's just sitting on the lawn like somebody's pet. That's really strange. <laughs> Thought we were gonna see him mauling. <laughs> He's back. Come around the corner. And there's a fox right here. They're like everywhere. We've seen three in like what, 300 yards? Mm -hmm. 